All right, so today's project, we'll be working on this power supply. Game Max VP600 RGB modular 80 plus bronze power supply. So it's actually a pretty decent power supply. I've, um, I've used it several times before, um, different versions of it. But this one, it's not that it's not working. It's just the fan is making a noise. So when you flip it around this way, I don't know if it catches on the camera, but you flip it around this way, like in the case I'm gonna put it in, the fan starts making this growling noise. But when you put it this way, the fan doesn't make the noise. And if I put it in a case this way, it's not gonna suck in any air and then it's gonna run high all the time. So it's kind of annoying. I did check the warranty on it and I did miss it. So what I'm gonna have to do is see if I can change this fan. So I've never done this before and I figure I document it to see if we can figure this out. So let's first off grab the right screw tools and see if we can get the screw off. I'm ready to take off the warranty sticker. Looks like it's got four screws, one on each corner over here. All right, maybe that lets it off easy. I don't know, I've never opened this one up before, so. Uh, let's see. I don't wanna to open too much. Oh, that was pretty easy. Okay, so now that we got it opened up, I need to trace where these wires go. Now, disclaimer, this power supply has been off for like weeks and I haven't used it, so I already know that it's not charged up or anything, so just kind of keep that in mind. But let's get it a little snipped. All right, let's cut these wire ties. Looks like it goes to this connector right over here. So before we start taking it down, I just want to get this power set. Looks like this connector goes to this right over here. All right, so looks like there's a little tab and I don't know how well this is gonna come out on the camera, but it looks like there's a little tab right here that's holding this connector down. So let's see if we can pop this thing up. All right, change of plan. So I don't have a four pin fan and this is a four pin over here. So after playing with it, this fan actually just kind of pops out over here. Just pull it out. And as you can see, it just has like, I guess this type of bearing. I'm not familiar with this, but um, it's pretty dry from what I can see. And I think that's the issue that's going on with it. So what I'm actually gonna try to do is um, I'm gonna grease this and see if that kind of gets rid of the noise and just kind of pack it with a little bit of grease and that should fix it, but it's very dry. And I think that's the issue that's going on with this. So let's try to put a little grease in it. Um, I don't have the right grease, but then again, it's better than nothing. Uh, I typically want to use a lithium grease, but I think this will be good enough. And if it does work, then what we will do is we'll actually come back and put the right grease in there and clean it out. So I just want to try this over here get it in as you can see i don't know if that comes out in the camera but get that in a little bit over there and just get a little more grease all right and hopefully that should do it i should be able to spin there's some actual grease on this piece over here and i need to take that grease out and get that let's see if we can get that out. there we go Yeah, we need a little more grease over here. This is all dried up. So we're gonna try that. That might work, it might not work. I don't know. But it's better than nothing, that's for sure. Let's try that. I 
it's still a really good power supply. Like I said, I've used it before tons of times and I had an issue, but all of a sudden this fan just decided to go a little silly with me. All right, let's just get a little grease up in there. This is actually wheel bearing grease for automotives, high temp. I mean, it's good enough for cars. It should work, right? Just pop you in. All right, it feels better. This might fix it. Okay, let's put you down. Okay. I think you have a little too much grease. Let's pop up some of this extra grease over here. So let's try this. Let's pop this back in to see if we can get that in. And see. It already feels smoother and quieter, so hopefully. I don't hear the noise no more. So that might have just been the issue. It just needed to be greased up, so. All right, so I guess let's try putting this back together, make it safe, and let's see if this works. If this works, then um, I saved a fan, and I saved $30 on a power supply, so, all right, let's get this back together. All right, so we got this together. So let's go ahead and give it power. All right, hopefully it don't blow up. Do our jumper. Use this to jumper it on, let's see. All right, sounds better already. This is the test right here. All right, it works good, so that was pretty easy. Just the fan needs to be greased up, so I put the grease in there, and now it seems to be running fine. I don't hear that annoying noise. When I used to flip around this way, I get that aggravating noise. I don't know if that comes on the camera. So it's running fine. Sweet, easy fix. So uh, thanks for watching. Comment down below, and we'll see what we come up with next.